With hands underneath the feet, start in a round back position. Flatten the back and lengthen the spine. This should give you a big hamstring stretch. Maintaining a flat back, pull yourself down and forward, letting the elbows flare out. Then slowly come up as you straighten the elbows and return to a round back position. The goal is for the legs to remain straight during the entire drill. If you're not there yet, I recommend elevating your hands so you can keep the legs straight rather than bending the knees. Notice here that I'm rounding my back and then bringing it to a flat, extended position here, really lengthening through that spine before I pull myself down deeper into the pike stretch. Do these slowly so you can feel each part of the movement, and once you're comfortable, you can speed it up. Feel free to try reversing the direction of the movement as well. Begin with a loaded PVC behind your back and use the weight to help you fold into your pike stretch. As you fold, the arms will naturally come up and all the way over the head. Eventually, the weight is pulling you deeper into the stretch. Bring the arms back up and over and straighten up to the starting position, bringing the loaded PVC in front of you before the next rep. If you can't get your arms overhead as you're folding forward, widen your grip on the PVC. The aim is for the legs to remain as straight as possible. Begin with arms reaching overhead and feet overhead. As slow as you can, roll your back down onto the floor one vertebrae at a time. Keep the thighs tight. Once your mid-back touches the ground, bend your knees and begin to extend the legs forward. As you do so, try not to let your butt hit the ground, so really use your core here. The shoulder blades are slightly elevated off the ground, so your core should be on fire. Bring the legs all the way out to a lockout, and then use a little momentum to bring them back to the starting position. The slower you go as you roll down, the more you'll be able to strengthen your active pike stretch, hollow body position, and a straight leg lockout, all of which correlate to a better pike stretch.